Hello everyone, have a very long down roll and have it flattened up to the middle and make two cuts, making into three equal parts. If you wear hairstyles, you know what to do. Braid it. If you don't know how to braid, it's very simple. First cross the first two and with the middle one, cross it with the third one. Then after that, do it until the bottom, then roll it to the top until the folded pattern. Then after that, make some dent by using chopstick on the rolled down. Then make it rolled against the pan recreator and secure it there. Have a circle shape down and place 6 dates equally apart from each other and place another layer of white dough on top of it and press it in between each of the dates by using a chopstick and press the dent towards the center and have a dent created by using a comb then have 3 little circle down and press on each of the sides by using a comb then have a cut in the middle and place it on top of each other and press it down by using a chopstick and have a date on the top and roll it down by forming a flower then extend the flower and drop it in the middle. Have three rolls of dough placed together and have a chopstick in the left and right middle and press it towards the center making a lump and have the chopstick placed perpendicular and have it pressed at the center then make the rolls apart then have it cut in the middle making it into half then after that place a lovely date in the middle of them and have the roll closed and have it extended and roll it towards the center do the same for all the rolls as well then after that we are done we have a lovely panel have a circle shape down and divide it into 6 equal quadrants then after that take each quadrant and have it fold towards the center from the curvy edge and place each quadrant on top of each other then after that make it come down and have it pressed in the middle on the triangular pan by using a chopstick then with multiple tips we have right have the top one combined together and with the remaining one make them on top of each other and the bottom one press a little bit now we have a lovely leaf have a thick circle shape dough and create 4 equal dents by using a wire on the diameter. Then have a pan create in the middle by using a comb. Then cut along the middle of the pan by using a scissor making a flower. Then also cut along the edges and also on the comb pattern at the bottom side and make it separate. Then you know what to do next. Place a cherry in the middle of each of them. Then have it combined by pinching them out. Do the same for all the quadrants and then place a cherry in the middle. Then we are done. Have two layers of white dough and press it in the middle by using the rubber part of the pencil. Then after that, fold it down towards the center on all the four quadrants and press it down at the center of the quadrant by using a chopstick and place the date at the center and with the layer behind it, have it pressed down by using a fork and in between each of the fork pattern we created, cut it down and pinch it by forming a flower design. Then we are done. Have a rectangular shape dough and make several cuts up to the middle on the broad side of it. Then after that, fold it from the top and make it completely come down. Then with several loops recreated, have it pressed in the middle by using a chopstick. Then after that, we combine the tips together, forming a loop. Then with the loops we have, have it pinched out by making a pedal design. Then with another circle shape dough in a thicker manner, have a pattern created by using a comb and make another perpendicular pattern, making a pistol of a flower. Have a circle shape dough and make 4 equal quadrants and for each quadrant, roll it towards the center having a little triangle at the end. Do the same for all the quadrants and have all of them combined together and have it pinched out in the middle by using a chopstick. Then after that, have the roll combined together at the bottom with the remaining rolls we have, fold it downwards on top of each other and flatten it at the sides and press it towards the middle by having a chopstick creating a dent and drop a cherry in the middle. Thank you everyone for watching this video.